Meredith had been on the phone with her sister. She sounded perfectly normal. She made no indication that anything was going on, didn't sound upset, but something was very wrong that night, and it's something that would have a big impact on this family. So at 7.17 a.m. on Sunday, January the 6th, the Metropolitan Fire Service was called to a house fire at the Pierce residence. Now, when they extinguished the flames, they found a pretty gruesome sight. 31-year-old Meredith's body was found in the couple's bedroom. Jamie, she was tied to a chair. She had a blue towel stuffed in her mouth. She had severe head wounds and an extension cord wrapped around her neck, which was essentially strangling her. And it doesn't stop there. 11-year-old Adam and 9-year-old Travis also were tied to chairs with plastic bags covering their heads. Two-year-old Carrie had been smothered to death. By some miracle, eight-year-old Matthew had been spending the night at a friend's house, so his life was spared. Autopsies revealed that the family had been killed well before the fire was set. The crazy thing is Stuart was not home, and he's never been seen since. So I think that's kind of an important piece moving forward. Like ever, like 31 years. Right. Yeah, not like he just wasn't seen, still hasn't been seen. Thank you for listening to this preview of True Crime Cast. You can find the rest of this episode, as well as over 200 other episodes, on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, Amazon Music, or wherever you find your favorite podcasts. You've listened to True Crime Cast, distributed by Stoveleg Media. Check out stoveleg.com to find out more about your hosts and to find other podcasts to listen to. Stoveleg Media, igniting conversation.